Hi, we're back again. Now I want you to remember this for any future painting. A lot of painters, a lot of good painters do not use black for shadows. And the reason why is that black sucks all the color out of your canvas. So find it, uh, make a habit to create darks from your primary colors. Now, if you are using, if you are using Hansa yellow, or if you are using Camion yellow, and if you use the the NAFTA red with this one you get you get orange but then if you drop in the blue the cerulean blue you get a totally dark almost a brown black but if you use um, a red orange with a hensa blue with a hensa yellow and you use a violet blue you get another dark color totally different at the same time so what you want to do is you want to create darks from using the three primaries but you can actually use different kinds of primaries so right here what I have here it looks like black it looks like shadows we're making more form for the little the little barn here but really what I've ended up mixing is cerulean blue and I've got some Cerulean, no, I've got, which one? I've got the red, the, the one I can never pronounce. What the heck is that? Oh. The cadmium red. And I've got the Hansa yellow. So here, which looks like quite dark, looks like almost black, is not actually black. So this is always a lot better with your uh, paintings you'll find it doesn't suck up your your colors so what I'm going to try out to do now right now is I'm going to create some kind of just definition a little bit you want to be bold about it oops especially in here So you're creating form. You're going to go back and create highlights on top of that. Right now I want to create, maybe make me, my brush a little watery. You're going to create some form maybe in between the stalks. You can have a, di a dry brush if you want. I don't want to make it even more drier. All right. So as you continue, as you can see, I like painting with my fingers. I always excelled in finger painting. Now, you don't want to put too much, but at the same time, you want to you don't want to be too timid with your darks because you remember you're going to come back in with your lights. Now this one is quite a free painting. It's not, you're not being formal with it at all. So I'm going to create a darker background here because I want to pop some lights here and there just to create some little bit of a Thing. So why don't you continue and play with your shadows and then we can come back and look at some highlights. <laughs> 